Hey guys, what is going on? It's Anthony Saltarella here with you again. Hey, you're probably wondering what the heck is with this hat? Where's my usual hat? Well, decided to get my Under Armour apparel on for you guys today. Ready to kick some ass and get this thing started. So, what do I want to talk about today? Well, I'd like to talk about starting with why. And why is this so important? Because a lot of you are on your entrepreneurial journeys. Um, some of you are farther along than others, but regardless, it's extremely important to know what your why is because just about everybody will run into times when they want to quit, you know, problems that arise or, you know, various situations that happen and they'll want to quit. And it's very important to know what your why is um, because that gives you a firm foundation that will something that you can look back on uh, to remind you why you started so I've got this book um, that I read a little while back start with why excellent book it's got a lot of awesome information in it on you know what your how to find what your why is um, and how to use it and in here they've got I'll try to find it here really quick they have a little diagram where is it? Right there. I don't know if you guys can see that, but basically right in the center you have your why, then how, and then your what. Um, a lot of people get their why and their what mixed up. Um, and by the way, that diagram is to show, basically it signifies most people know what their what is um, a lot of people know what their how is and very few people know what their why is and very important to know all those things uh, a lot of people like I was saying get mixed up with their why and their and their what now, a lot of people you know get started in the entrepreneurial journey and their they think their why is you know to make a huge amount of money and that's really a what um, so very important to know um, another great book that I read actually just recently is this one right here millionaire success habits and what I like about it is it kind of um, finishes this book because this book doesn't clearly tell you how to find your why um, it, it tells you how important it is but it doesn't quite go into the details on how to find what your why is if you don't already know what it is. And so the Millionaire Success Habits actually goes into that in detail. In fact, he's got a little um, form that he fills out, a little worksheet that you can fill out to determine what your why is. Um, so basically, it goes like this. If you're, if you're having pro a trouble finding what your why is, um, you can, there's seven questions, seven level, he calls it the seven level deep exercise. Uh, it's basically seven questions that you can ask. Hey Kelly, good to see you. Basically seven questions that you can ask um, to get to the bottom, drill down to the bottom of what your why is. So for, here's a little example of how it would work. So the first question, what is important to you about achieving the ideal you? And what is important to you about becoming successful? It's the first question. Answer, make more money. So then you move on to the second question. Why is it important for you to make more money? Answer, get out of debt. So, you, so you're, starting to, you're starting to get a little more in depth about what their why is as you get farther along. So then, why is it important for you to get out of debt? That's the third question. Answer, stop working so hard to pay someone else. So, starting to see a little bit more about why he wants to do what he's doing. So, question number four, why is it important for you to stop working? Because I want to do things in my life with the fruits of my labor. Question number five, why is it important for you to do things in your um, blank 
Why is it important for you to do things in your life with the fruits of your labor? Answer, to take care of my mother who is widowed and needs help. So see, now we're starting to get a little bit more into the, you know, the nitty gritty of why he wants to do what he wants to do. He wants to help his, his widowed mother out. So the question number six, specifically, why is it important for you to take care of your widowed mother? Because she sacrificed everything to send me to college, and I want to make sure she is taken care of in her golden years. All right, so now we're starting to really get deep on what his why is. So question number seven, the final question, why is it important for you to take care of her? Because I want to be in control of my life so I can help those around me who can't help themselves know they are precious, worthy, and loved. So see, we finally got down to what his real why is. So very powerful exercise. I definitely recommend that uh, you do it if you haven't already. Um, it'll give you something that you can fall back on in those times when you want to quit. Um, you know, you, you run into problems that make you want to quit your journey. And all you have to do is write down your why and put it up on your wall and look at it during those times. And it'll give you the strength that you need to keep moving towards your goal. So I hope that that was helpful to you guys. Um, if there's any future topics that you would like me to cover in uh, future videos, be sure to leave them in the comments below and I'll be sure to cover them. And I hope that you all have a good night, a good morning, wherever you are, are in the world. And we'll see you on the next live.